Applicants of the Joint Admissions and Matriculation Board JAM examination are complaining about difficulty in the registration process and getting a national identity number. TVC News correspondent Sharon De Jason has details in this report. Like me now, I came here since 5 o'clock. There is no probability that I'll collect it today. And I've registered since June, imagine. And they won't give us the sleep today. They are telling us that from 200 downward, they are not answering them today again. Imagine that, that kind of thing. And they say Nigeria is getting better. It's getting worse, so please. This is the dilemma of applicants at the Alawusa Lagos Office of the National Identity Management Commission, NIMC. According to them, the process is untidy. Parents, guardians and applicants are concerned about the difficult process involved in getting a national identity number. According to them, it is tedious, hence it seems unachievable. If people could help me to check the government, if they should just allow these children this year to register jam, maybe by next year, then we'll be able to start this thing on time. The information may be two, three weeks interval. We must get it. Just look at crowd suffering us. I think Nigeria they are feeling from uh, adults, youth, now they are suffering teenager. 14, 15 years child, staying here by 2, 2 a.m., waiting for this kind of nonsense, till now you will not still get just here. You see old women, everybody suffering. I got to one of the centers and I was number 178. Okay, let's assume they were calling this according to, uh, let's, let's assume they were calling this serially. At least I would have hope that hey, it's moving. Then you just see somebody will just come. Get me. As far as if you just know, if you know some of those, the staffs that are there, they'll just do it for you. In my own country, I want to, I want to get a national ID card, an identity card, then I'm still going through this stress. It's not something to write them about. It will be recalled that the registrar of JAMP, Professor Isha Koloyede, had explained that the aim was to ensure that the biometrics and other personal details of a candidate are captured towards checking examination practices. In a swift reaction, an official at the NIMC debunked corrupt activities at the Lagos Office of the Commission. He, however, assured applicants that they will work more hours to meet their demands. What the law says is that the giver and the receiver of bribe are guilty. The enrollment service is free. So whoever is paying for services to either to be enrolled or to be issued the card is going to be arrested going forward. Once we arrest you, you will fish out the person you pay the money to. And both the receiver and the giver will be prosecuted in line with the law. 25th August 2019 was when the Joint Admission Matriculations Board Registrar Professor Ishak Oloyede announced that students who are seeking admission at um, the tertiary institutions in the country will need a national identification number for the process to be successful. Many of these applicants are tired, are hungry and may be frustrated. They want the relevant authorities to have a holistic look on the several emerging issues that is coming up as registration begins from next week. Sharon Ijasson, TVC News, Lake.